basically going like just got finished work 10 hours I'm on my way now to pick up Avery uh, from daycare she's got a soccer game tonight it's her first soccer game of the season so we shall see what happens with that you know when you you sit at work for 10 hours a day and especially it's a job that you're not like really passionate about and you're pretty much looking at the clock the whole time seeing when quitting time is it tends to make you think about things my greatest inspiration for doing vlogging and probably like millions of other people too is Casey Neistat and one thing that he's like he's not only a great vlogger um, but he's also just a very interesting person has a lot of good good common sense views on things and one thing that he said in, in a vlog of his was if you want to find out what you really want to do go and doing something you hate meaning meaning is that the drive to get out of that situation will drive you to something that you really want to do I've been teetering between uh, trying to do what I love which is video production videos music videos everything and above photography and trying to juggle that with doing a regular job to to make sure that the the bills are paid and I'm finding lately with me taking on more video stuff it's more of a challenge to do the video stuff because I'm dedicating so much time to the regular job and it's becoming increasingly frustrating to me lately I just I've had this extra drive and, and extra passion just to you know to really go and do this and pursue it and see what happens and unfortunately that the regular job is just really getting in the way of that right now especially I mean we're working you know 10 hour days and when you devote that much time to a job and then you figure in life after that there's not a whole lot of breathing room after that so lately I've been thinking more you know what what can I do to increase the time I have to do the stuff that I love versus the, the stuff that I have to and it's coming to the realization now that things need to change the thing with, with working a regular job is it's this guaranteed money so there's there's no risk involved you just show up you do your time and you leave and then you get a paycheck in the mail or you get a paycheck in your checking account there's no risk in that and the reward the immediate reward is you get money and you, you can be comfortable knowing that that money is going to be in there every week but the the long term re what is the long term reward what have you really accomplished how have you improved yourself if you're doing the same thing you were last year and living comfortably and i've been trying to teeter back and forth between doing what i love to do and living comfortably and it's just not working and i think everyone who has aspirations to do better and be better comes to this point in time in their life where it's like do i play it safe and just keep doing the status quo or do i take a chance where i want to be is i want to be independent i want to be able to work for myself doing what i love and not have a boss and not had to live to a certain schedule or work for somebody else for no reward other than a paycheck that's my goal and what can I do to achieve that goal and I think I had actually a lot of uh, a few moments of epiphany today this is the time where things need to change all right so that's probably enough of me blabbing on today let's get moving on to the next thing ready for your first soccer game yeah yeah are you excited or not really? I'm excited. Yeah, I hope you do good today. Yeah. I hope you get to play defense. That's your favorite, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Time to go to soccer.
Okay, well, soccer game is all finished. They didn't get the win today, but my little one did pretty good on defense, so positive attitude all the way. I still have yesterday's vlog to edit, as well as today's, so I am going to be busy for the rest of the night. So that means I am going to say goodbye, see you tomorrow.